Okay. This might have happened to us. Might happen to you out there. We don't know. Get a lift. Talking about getting blacklisted. Fired from guitar shops. Fired. Fired. I, Not I as an employee. I didn't, I didn't. As a customer. I didn't know this was a thing. I, know. I didn't know this was a thing until like, well, until I talked to some guys that ran some of the biggest guitar shops in the country. Right. Um, from independent all the way to the biggest one that has a two letter little acronym that we all know and love. But, um, and I was finally like, wait, there's a list of people that you guys don't sell it to. And they're like, Oh, a hundred percent. And we passed this list around. And then once we entered the guitar shop game, I was like, there is a list. I didn't know it was, a, it's like the list to get into the club, but reverse. Reverse. <laughs> it's really strange. Blackballed. I just didn't know. So like, we were like, God, what, what do you have to do to get banned from your guitar shop? So we kind of came up with the sort of the list of the list of how you get on the list for the list. Um, just like certain things. And, but, but then we were like, well, you know, there's a lot of serious stuff. Let's make it a little fun too. Yeah. Let's look at the casino version of it. Maybe. Maybe. Right? Yeah. But I mean, and then we'll, we'll give we'll have some funny tips here. Well, I mean, I'll just give it away. We've officially never banned anybody either. <laughs> Because we these are the things we maybe make us want to be. <laughs> no, but this is stuff that I've talked to other like heads of some of the big, the big corporate ones that we know and love, and then heads of them some of the greatest independent ones too. And like, and I was like, oh okay, that tracks. That makes sense. We just haven't had that. Maybe we haven't been around long. Enough. You know, I was thinking about our little our list. There's also some exceptions, probably in my mind, who people who have done some of these things that we love. Yeah, because we love them, we don't we yes. don't care. Well, I mean, <laughs> It's it's kind of like being married. It is. It's, it's like not you, a you fall in love with like it's not a fair. It's the wrong person. You gotta stay there because that's what you said you do, in the eyes of God. Continue. So number one, um, this one's sort of a funny one. I think this is an in store thing, not the online stuff or whatever. But I'm tuning every yeah. guitar in the acoustic section usually to some weird open tuning just to go try stuff out. No intention of buying usually. You say you are, but you're not. But you're just but leaving it that way. Ninety nine percent of the time. They never did. We never. The guitar never leaves the showroom. <laughs> it's amazing though how quickly they can do it. Because I'll go back and be tuned in the mornings, like you know, sometimes oh, I'm like, yeah. "Wow, this guitar is really out of tune." And I get the next one, "Wow, this one's really out of tune." The same way, damn it! And then I realize it's and the worst is to do a twelve string like that too. And it's always luckily that's rare. It's very rare, but it's always the dude trying to show it off to his girl. Like, you know, it's like check this out. And this is my one lick I learned in open D, and I'm on. And, just, just tune it back. It's like, I don't know, let's just... Yeah, yeah let's tune it back. Or, or, I don't know, or let us know. Or, or tune it back. Just tune it back, yeah. <laughs> or do one guitar. But I mean, that I guess works. if you... you and know, tune it back. And tune it back. Okay, moving on. Sort of like rewinding on your VHS tapes. Be kind, please rewind. Remember that? The, yeah, I mean, or get charged that rewind. I did. God, you know what, that, that was terrible. Um, <laughs> Number two is the, this one is actually a real one that... This is the most likely to get you on the the ban list from the the big corporate. I was gonna ones. say, I think with the big the big folks, this uh, is this, this is, should be number one. But we just thought yeah. number one was funnier, so we led with that. Um, it's the repeat returner. Ooh, it's um if you are if you're a habitual buyer returner tester, I'm gonna play it in my. Game.